Luke gives us uh, obvious uh, experience, uh, intelligence, toughness, leadership. Even moved out to tight end and helped us there, but now he is uh, one of the great leaders in this tough offensive line and us transitioning from a passing offense to a more balanced offense. Uh, and he has been one of the keys to that success. I just want to be able to help us to, um, you know, an offense to move the ball or to protect or whatever I can do to help us you know, score points so uh, we can be successful. He's a big country guy. I, I, I love Luke. I mean, he's a good personality. He always comes to workouts and practice with, I mean, just, you know, great intensity. <laughs> he's the first lineman I know to score a touchdown. <laughs> As like in, in our little one-hour packages deals, and and he said that he would grab his belly and kind of roll it. It was kind of funny. Burns with a second down, rolling out, looks to the wide open. Luke Pelman, touchdown Texas. Let me say his name again, folks. Luke Pelman, the touchdown, the junior from Brenham. It was just really fun. I mean, it it, it didn't seem like my touchdown. It felt like. Really, kind of felt like the old Lions touchdown. That was the best thing that we, we've ever had an offensive line. I bet because it's just a fun thing. Because just because that shaking of the stomach was monumental for the offensive line. <laughs> oh, he did the big boy, the big boy celebration. He did, and it's good to see an offensive lineman get a touchdown. It doesn't happen often, so when it does, we uh, we celebrate appropriately. Luke getting the ball is the. It's just, I know it was great for him, but I, it was great for the rest of the line. Cause Luke's just such a great on the team. Everybody loves him. I'm really involved with uh, Young Life, which is like a, um, a ministry to high school and middle school kids. I really love doing that. It's kind of, uh, I'm, I guess I really feel called to that. I actually got to the, the opportunity to go with them this May and go to a um, Young Life Work Week in Arizona where we just basically got the, this camp set up and it was just a great, great trip to get, just get to know Luke better in that aspect. It's, it's really grown into um, kind of my uh, passion to do the same for others. Always comes to work with a great attitude. He's, he's cutting up when it's when it's time to, and he's, he's really serious when it's time to go to work. The sermon of like when it's important to speak, when not to speak, when what to say. I've always tried to um, to learn that and like watch from older guys and um, coaches and, and learn that. I hope that it's something that like I've started to um, understand and maybe even master a little bit. He knows the time and place for everything, but he's definitely. Definitely a free spirit, and he wants everyone else to be like that and just, just enjoy their time. He's got these, uh, I guess, these impersonations that he does that are really just kind of, it's serious, but at the same time, they, uh, they kind of make you relax a bit. A team joke is we'll do the William Wallace speech sometimes after a game or something, and uh, that was like, I, I look at everybody and go, all right, lads, let's get going here. Everybody take up their arm, hold the line, and let's break through these sons of cracks. All right. Pull it up from your gully and pull it up from your heart. And let's get rocking all right there, lads. We enjoy doing what we're doing and we have a conviction about it. Like, we're going to accomplish our other goals. Like, other stuff's going to fall into place and we're going to play hard and we're going to have fun in the game. And ultimately, that's going to lead to victories.